I've had a couple questions to talk about hanging punctuation or Roman punctuation. And I have hanging punctuation turned on here. What happens is things get lined up, okay? And if the quote marks were lined up, it looks off just a bit. So if I were to turn off the hanging punctuation, as you can see, this is hanging out so that the words are all lined up. So here's how you do it in InDesign and have this text box um, connected and I hit type and then go to story and then I hit optical margin, margin the Roman hanging punctuation. Um, therefore, this does not look as good. I'm just gonna click off of it. And you can kind of see, it kind of feels like there's a, a stutter or a hole before it begins. And you can really see it down here and get a little bit more of an idea what I'm talking about. So again, I just go to type and then go down to story. First off, I have to select my type box and I'm gonna go to type and then story and then click optical adjustments and that's what happens. So I'm gonna leave that. If for some reason it wasn't far enough, I would have adjusted that optical margin so I could actually push the um, down or up. I can move it over it was at 12. I think 12 was probably good. And let me tell you about ellipses. This is a correct ellipses, which is not period space, period space, period space, which most people think. I actually want to highlight all these. I'm holding the option key down and then clicking the colon. And it makes the correct ellipses that was built for this font. I have the same thing. I already typed this is just three dots. This is three dots with spaces. Um, again, I'm going to hit option semicolon. Now it will look different with every typeface. So if I change this type to Baskerville regular, the ellipses probably looks a little bit better. But let's go ahead and talk about hanging punctuation here. So again, you would get your paragraph palette out. If you don't already have it, you can always go to window and then uh, paragraph. It's under the type palette, paragraph. But it's already up. So I'm just going to go over here to this right hand and I'm going to click it and then this is it. This is all I get. I get this hanging punctuation. Um, but let's say I wanted to adjust this. I can adjust it this way and get more to that. Now granted it's different because it has that ellipses and that's how you do hanging punctuation. Ellipses, same way. It's the option key or the alt key if you're on a PC I think and then the colon. 